had a couple people show up, so I want to give them an opportunity to introduce themselves. There may be some businesses in the room or some other partners that may have some interest in your service offerings. So, John, please. Hi, I'm John Leno, Interface Financial Group. We provide financing to uh, commercial uh, construction contractors. My son, Zach. Thank you very much. Well, what you see in front of you on the, both of our screens here, isn't this great? Those of you who haven't been here before, I love having the two screens. This is trouble for me. Um, <laughs> so if you look at the page, you'll see, first of all, that EIW is up and running. We do now have a website. So those of you who are unfamiliar with uh, uh, the resources that EIW is trying to develop uh, and possesses uh, presently, this tells you a little bit about us. It gives you information. Oops, get down here. This is I'm in the wrong place. I need to be sitting. So forgive me. I'm going to sit down and try to operate this really briefly. Okay. So again, this is our home page. What is EIW? If anyone tells you, our tag eiwashington.org. We try to keep it as simple as possible. We also have a YouTube uh, station uh, developed, and uh, the tag is? EI Washington. Everything's EI Washington. Um, those of you, uh, obviously you see cameras around, so we televise all of our meetings. And uh, after we go through and edit the videos so they're viewable from our website, no one wants to watch two hours of footage. Uh, we're going to edit them down and have them available on our EIW uh, channel. So there'll be an opportunity for those who may have had value of attending today's meeting but wasn't able to make it. Hopefully this will be the gift that keeps on giving. This will also be a medium that we'll use in our professional development. So as we are developing uh, training uh, curriculums, we'll be able to <coughs> refer back to that if someone was uh, unable to grab that information and retain it, we'll have an opportunity to, to actually catalog it in a library. Um, Mel over here, who is working the laptop, she may be making updates as, as we talk. Uh, she has really volunteered a great deal of time and energy away from her business to help uh, EIW get to this position. And uh, for that, I am eternally grateful and uh, for all the work that she does, I believe she definitely deserves a hand. <laughs> so I'm just basically just kind of scrolling through the page. On the right side of the page, if you're interested in becoming a member, some of you have already gone through this process. It's a fairly straightforward uh, process. We're not trying to create a cumbersome application, answer a few questions, uh, and we have uh, one document for you to sign. Um, and that's all it really requires, at least for this year. We do, we are a 501c3, so we do uh, solicit and appreciate uh, funds and donations that are uh, for the organization, uh, but it's not a requirement to join. Uh, you agencies, we have a program that we're developing, so <laughs> we'll be talking to you later. <laughs> um, as you continue to look at the website, you'll see a contact us page. I don't need to go there. You guys can pretty much guess what that page is about. However, that calendar is something that's going to be very useful for you. Today, presently, we have one uh, item on that calendar. At our next meeting, you're going to see a combination of opportunities that uh, our speakers, like Julie and Jackie, have uh, forwarded to us, as well as opportunities that have been forwarded to my firm, as well as some of our board members' firms, and some of our other members. And we're going to consolidate that information to be uh, integrated into our calendar. And they're going to be color coded. So job opportunities are going to be color coded one, one color. Contract opportunities are going to be another color. If they're training opportunities, uh, there'll be a color. If there's financial and lending opportunities, John, are you listening? Those will be another color. So what we're trying to do is really develop a one-stop shop place for people to get information. We may not have all the information here. But we can give you a summary level information that tells you, hey, should I be pursuing this information with the state or with the city or the feds? Uh, or should I pass on this based on the information I have? So what we're trying to do is empower the, uh, the small businesses. At the same point of empowering those small businesses, we want to also provide that same type of uh, advertising and um, 
branding for your businesses. If you don't have a website, please raise your hand. Like the only one. Oh, okay. <laughs> two of us. We got two. Okay. So obviously it would be beneficial for for you to have a website just to communicate what your service offerings are. However, to have a website that actually can be an active tool to generate income and revenue for your business is a whole nother thing. And that's what the EIW is really about. We're not trying to um, uh, continue doing what you've been doing. We would like to refine what you've been doing and try to introduce you to some of those practices that some of the larger firms that we've been exposed to are using and empower your organization with some of those tools. So um, this, this page right here is our board members. So you'll have an opportunity to see some of our board members and learn a little bit of information on them. However, our goal is to have that same kind of information on each and every one of you. So when someone comes to our site, they want to learn something about Gates Consulting, they'll have that opportunity. And they'll also have a link to your site. And any of the sponsors or initiatives that you may be working on tied to your organization. So to me, it's an empowering tool. EIW was trying to provide this, these types of resources free or at a discount to its membership. So this is kind of what we're trying to do. So if you have any ideas, um, if you haven't signed up, we need you to go through that and do that. How do you get involved? Hey, guess what? There's a button for you. <laughs> you click that button and this is what it takes you to. And we're developing a, a, ver a very simplified uh, database inside, inside this website. However, we're also uh, in talks with Microsoft and a few other third party uh, vendors. We, we, this is some other good news, by the way. We were accepted by Microsoft to be a nonprofit that they can have dedicate staff to developing systems within our organization. So the one priority that I requested from Microsoft is to help us develop a sophisticated database that we can use to log information on our membership, help become more of an empowering financial partner with, the, with their collective organization, develop statement of qualifications, business planning, financial summarized reporting to be available through that via that database that can integrate into our website. It may sound like a lot, but basically what we're trying to do is develop some systems that the big businesses are practicing every day. And we would like to be able to pass those types of systems on to our small business members. Some of you may think, oh, well, I don't need to review my financials every month or every quarter. Well, you may not, but we're going to give you the tools to do that. And we're also going to have a board and subject matters experts around us that can analyze your financials and provide recommendations. They may be looking at your cash flow calendar, they may be looking at your WIP and saying, well, hey, I'm looking at your WIP and it looks like second quarter, you're gonna be a little light on cash. You may wanna go talk to John and be proactive rather than waiting until you can't make payroll. So again, we're trying to be proactive. There's some other uh, sexy things that I'm working on in the website, but they're a little too sexy for me to talk about. So I'm going to work those out with you. Um, the blog, I'm very excited about the blog. Um, we are identifying every time an opportunity is distributed and passed to membership. We're trying to post this information onto the website so you can go there and get this information instead of being spammed with 457 million emails. And I know Platinum's been hitting you pretty hard. The goal is to get out of that and get to a place where you can come log in once a day and find out about good opportunities. We also have some ideas in integrating commodities um, as well as uh, uh, news, important news that may impact uh, the pricing on some of the projects that you're considering. So we're thinking about incorporating graphics that, incorpor that may tie into gypsum prices, lumber prices, fuel prices, things that are going to impact your competitiveness on projects. Um, I'm going to talk a little more about the organization, but I don't want to until we have an opportunity to hear from our speakers. So the first speaker is Jackie Bain with the State of Washington Department of Transportation Equal Opportunity Office, and she has come here to talk to us about the WASDOT Small Business Program 
and related resources tied to that program, the DBE program and related resources tied to that organization, the DBE disparity study and related milestones tied to that DBE disparity study, and professional development training and technical assistance programs that are available for 